Greetings everyone. Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 7th February 2023. Starting off with the updates from the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court dismissed the petitions which challenged the appointment of advocate L Victoria Gauri as a judge of the Madras High Court. She was also in news for taking a oath today at the Madras High Court. Next, the Supreme Court while hearing the appeal in Devu G versus state of kerala state the order of kerala high court which directed a 23 year old woman who was admittedly in a same sex relationship to undertake counseling the supreme court while hearing the case of messrs pla projects versus mahanadi coal fields refused to close contempt proceedings against lawyers who actively participated in the strike and vandalism of the court premises while demanding the formation of new benches of the Orissa High Court in the case of Raj Kumar versus State of Uttar Pradesh the Supreme Court issued several directions to institutionalize the process of premature release of prisoners it directed the UP government to dispose of the cases of remissions within 3 months from the date the prisoner becomes eligible Next we have the news updates from the high courts. Firstly, the Bombay High Court while hearing the PIL titled Sayyid Usama versus Maharashtra wherein the petitioner sought guidelines for police mock drills has directed that no mock drills be conducted depicting persons of a particular community as terrorist till the next date of hearing. The next date of hearing in the matter is scheduled for February 10th. Calcutta High Court has held that the action of removing undergarments of the victim and possibly making her lie down on the ground cannot be for any other reason but for the purpose of ravishing her next calcutta high court in the case of prasant bhata versus abdul sk while observing that mistake on part of the advocate in representing any party shouldn't act as a prejudice against such party set aside the order of acquittal passed under section 138 of the negotiable instrument act this concludes the news for today thank you very much